Good morning, you guys. I am all packed up. It's not morning. It's 12.30. I'm leaving for work. I can show you my outfit really quick. I'm just wearing this big jean shirt and this striped little dress with my Converse. Pretty simple. Um, I'm kind of feeling really tired today. I didn't sleep again very well last night. I got enough sleep, but in weird, weird patterns. But anyways, um, yeah, I'm off to work. I will see y'all. When I get home at like 10 o'clock, man. Okay, so when I'm on my way to work, I admittedly guilty. When I'm at like stoplights, I read my um, comments on my videos, like my emails, they get emailed to me and then I just read through them. I read through every single one of them. And specifically on the one where I was mentioning, you know, uh, applying for the job in Dubai and going there and leaving Bella for two years. Now, I just wanna like clear that up, you guys. Um, she would be with my mom and uh, I have left Bella before, um, not like I wanted to, but I left her when I thought I was moving to Dallas. Um, she's very happy at home with my mom. My mom, she loves my mom just as much, if not more than me, I swear. When I first bought her and then I went away to college, she was with my mom for over a year. Um, I would visit her. She has, my mom has the same dog as she, as Bella is, so they're like best friends. She has a huge yard to run in, so I don't want you to think that I would just be deserting Bella or anything like that, because you guys know Bella is like my other half. I absolutely love her, but at the same time, she would, I mean, if she could talk, she would rather me do this once in a lifetime sort of thing, and if I could bring her in a heartbeat, I would. I just don't know if I can, so that was always an option, and I talked about that from when I first got my job. My mom, my mom knows how much I want to go this overseas route, and and um, yeah, she was like, you know I'll watch Bella, and she always has. So I want you to just relax about that sort of stuff, you guys, because obviously you know I love Bella. She is the love of my life, but um, it's two years of my life, and she'll be there, and she will be so happy to have free reign. She has a huge yard in New York to run around in, so I honestly feel like she would be happy doing that than living in an apartment in Dubai. So I would make the best decision for her, not just about me, so I don't want you to think I'm selfish. I absolutely love my dog, and there's no there's no way in hell I would want to give her away, but she would be with my mom, so it's, yeah, I think of it as like being with me. I, I trust my mom, she raised me. She's amazing with Bella, Bella absolutely loves her. When she comes to visit, Bella is all about her and not about me, so <laughs> I just want to like clear that up for you guys. Um, yeah, so don't worry you guys. I love Bella and she'd be fine no matter what happens in life. I would miss her like crazy, but she's a tough little soldier and yeah, she's fine. She's good. good morning you guys. I'm just leaving Dunkin' Donuts. I picked up some Dunkin' Donuts for my coworkers today or my associates because I made them stay really late last night to get everything done and I have to be there at eight, so. I picked myself up a bagel sandwich, a coffee, and we got some donuts, so I think they're gonna be happy about it. Yeah. Hey y'all, I am on my way home. It is still sunny. It's never sunny when I leave work, uh, unless I it's three o'clock and I'm doing the update or something, but it's 5.13 and I am on my way home from work. I am super sleepy. Um, ooh, I just think I like sneezed out of my nose a little bit, but anyways. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm going home. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I can't nap even though I'm tired. Um, I'm gonna try not to nap. I wish I had a bottle of water. I'm thirsty. Anyways, I'm gonna try to work out tonight while dance. Um, and then I need to upload a video, possibly film one, but I don't really feel like it. So. I don't know, we'll see. I'm not feeling all that uh, energetic today. Not the toy. Not hey the guys, so I just took like a quick 20 minute nap because I was a little sleepy. I snuggled and watched Pretty Little Liars and passed out for like 20 minutes, which was just what I needed. Um, my camera's working back there, so I uploaded footage. I'm going to edit it, but first I'm going to go home and go, I mean, go home. Go upstairs and dance for a little while, get some cardio in. Then I'll come down and edit a video and maybe film. I don't know, I have good energy now that I took just like a 20 minute nap, really refreshed me and I'm feeling so much better. So, um, ooh, let me just turn off this video, turn it up. Ooh. 
a little bit of snow in there. Okay, thanks. So I am mm, 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 clearing my throat. I did a workout. I really need a shower because I stink. Um, I did my workout. It was fun. I had a lot of fun dancing again. I'm actually looking up another dance video because I really, really, really liked um, that. It was like a lot of fun. And it's like 8.30. I'm going to hop in the shower as soon as I watch this. I just edited a vlog and I'm going to post that. No, not a vlog. A regular video. Yeah, a beauty video. And I'm going to post a vlog tomorrow. So that's that. I'm going to try to get to sleep early. I tried to tire myself out um, so I can actually sleep tonight. Praise the Lord, hopefully. Um, I'm not going to wash my hair tonight. I'm going to wash it tomorrow. But I do want to shower and do a sunless tanner maybe tonight. Mm, maybe. But anyways... Um, I'm going to watch a new Blogilates dance and see if I like this one. And, yeah, hopefully I do because I'm ready hey for y'all, it's been a little while since I vlogged. Um, I am looking crazy, of course. But I just, I got out of the shower a little while ago. I didn't wash my hair. I just, like, threw it up in a bun. I washed my body, shaved, put on some sunless tanner. Woohoo! haven't done that in, like, months. And I'm painting my nails. This is OPI's, I don't know. Let me check. Kiss me, I'm Brazilian. It's just a nice bubble gummy pink. I figure I'm like ready for spring to come, so yeah, I love it. Even though spring's not coming anytime soon. But well, when does the first day of spring? I don't even know to be honest with you. Anyways, um, and then I'm watching uh, Nikki Philippi's morning routine. I'm thinking about filming a new one. But I might wait a little while um, until I actually get a morning routine. I feel like I've been really out of whack with my mornings lately that I need to start getting into a morning routine. And it's one of those things my co one of my like associates uh, at work today was talking about how she like is like setting herself like a morning routine and getting like up really early and all that kind of stuff. And I'm like, I kind of was like, you're crazy. But then I started thinking about it and I was like, hmm, maybe she's not all that crazy. I wish my hair wasn't super wonky, but I'm going to try waking up earlier so that way hopefully I can sleep through the night. Like I, if I have to wake up earlier, I will eventually exhaust myself until the point where it's like I have to sleep. So I took like about a 20 minute nap today, so hopefully I shouldn't be too tired, but it's around 10, 20 and I'm probably planning on going to bed at like 10, 30, quarter to 11 and waking up around 6, 37 is my game plan. So fingers crossed, hopefully that works. Uh, I have a to-do list tomorrow, and I do want to get a lot accomplished before I have work at 1 o'clock, so wish me luck. Good morning. Well, good afternoon. It's 12.30. It's my day off. I have my interview at 2, but me and B, shotgun rider. Are you a shotgun rider? She's like, no. We're on our way to go get Starbucks coffee because I need some energy, a little pep in my step for this interview. Wish me luck, you guys. I'm so excited. So I just got my coffee and I got some really good news, you guys. I am a great cousin, something like that. My cousin just had a baby, a baby boy. I'm so excited. Um, I'm sure my, co my cousin, yeah, my cousin's husband, who's also my cousin, he normally watches my videos, but I'm sure he won't have any time to watch my videos now because he's going to be a papa. So I'm really excited. What a good day. It's so exciting when like, I don't know, I've never had a baby born in my family, ever. So, it's really exciting. I'm happy about it. And, um, yeah, I just want to just say, oh, life is good. Look at the bee in the background. She's like, what's up, ma? I'll just check it out the window. My coffee is like spot on. Good day. Ready to nail this interview in an hour and 20 minutes. Ah! What is Bella Hey, guys. So, I'm all set up for my interview. Oh, I'm getting excited. <laughs> um, yeah, really excited about it. I'm just wearing a top dot, um, very minimal, minimal makeup, and then my little dump, denim jumper thing. I don't know. I'm so excited and so nervous. <laughs> so she just added me on Skype, the lady who's doing my interview. I'm freaking out, you guys. I don't know. I'm like so nervous. Oh, I wish you luck. I'm so freaking nervous. I haven't had an interview. Oh my God. I can't even find this out. Okay, guys. I gotta look it up. I'm a weirdo. I'm so nervous. I'm like staring at myself, reading back some questions that I think they could ask me. I'm like a freak right now, you guys. I don't know why I'm so scared, but I think I might actually video myself while it's going, like record it um, and see how I do because I'm really excited and nervous to see. I don't know. I'm like freaking out. I have like, oh my God, any minute now she's going to be calling me. 
Hey guys, so I just got done with my interview. It went really well. It was super easy. Uh, it was basically just the first step. It's a three step process. I'll sit down and tell you. Uh, it's like a three step process. So the first process was just like getting to know me and like my interest in the company. And it was with this girl, Andrea, or Andrea, Andrea, Andrea. She's so sweet. She was a really, really nice girl. Um, she's worked for the company for a very long time. She was a senior recruiter, which is kind of cool, and a DM. And she's like a big, big person. And she's married and has a kid. But anyways, um, so yeah, that, it went really well. And then the second interview is with her boss. So I'll know by next week if I made it to the second interview process. So, ah! And then after the second interview process, it's a third interview. And for the third interview, if I make it to the second, or make it through the third, or through the second, it's the third interview and they fly you out to home office, which is in Ohio. And you have an all day sort of interview and meeting with like everyone. So that's really exciting. And yeah, so I made it through to my second, I made it for, through my first interview, really, really excited about it. Second interviews with the, um, her boss, a guy who's like the head of the mobile the global mobility um, team. So exciting. And yeah, and then I'm hoping, I'm really fingers crossed. I get it, but it was really good. I felt good, she made me feel really comfortable. There wasn't a question that I didn't know how to answer because it was all very personal life about myself and hopefully yeah she liked me I hope so and she even asked me where my chair was because she liked my chair <laughs> and anyways yeah so hopefully fingers crossed I have tomorrow I have my interview my second interview like a couple weeks and oh I'm just so stinking excited you guys it was good it was good I hope I got good feedback from her so hopefully hopefully she liked but yay, it's either Dubai or Abu Dhabi. Mostly Dubai is where they're looking for. So, God, so excited. I thought I would show you my outfit really quick. I'm just running to grab some sushi with Lisette over here. It's just up. I have this necklace on that I got from my FabFitFun box. There's a bell bar. I was blank in the background. I have my phone charging. <laughs> this shirt is just from, I don't know where. It's just a basic black V. My shorts are Abercrombie and my shoes are these like little... Indian looking little things. Look at my floor mess um, from Target. So that's it. I'm really hungry and I'm so excited for this. Hey guys, so I'm on my way to the restaurant to get some sushi. I'm so hungry. I haven't eaten anything today. It's five o'clock. I know that's not good, but I was so nervous for my interview that I thought I would throw up if I ate something. So I just had a coffee and that's it. It's bad, I know, but I'm about to go get some sushi and chow down like a dang pig. I'm um, so hungry. And then this guy that I had been talking to and then I told you I stopped talking to him and then I started talking to him and then he like talked to me, blah, 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 you know all that scene. He asked me to go out and grab drinks tonight. And he's lucky I'm in a good mood. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Like I really like him a lot and wish things like if I wasn't moving with my career then things would probably happen between us. He's not a mean guy. It's just I get frustrated because he's not the guy that I wanted him to be when I wanted him to be that guy. You know? You know, but I'll let you the go. Good morning. I'm gonna put you up there so I can talk to you. Good morning. It's Saturday morning. I look like a crazy hot mess. I'm on my way to work. It's like quarter to ten. I'm exhausted. My hair looks like not cute. Anyways, so last night was fun. Um, I went out to dinner with Lisette. It was good. We had sushi, and then um. I feel like I'm getting sick or something. I don't know. Maybe I'm just really tired and haven't talked yet. Um, but then I hung out with um, the guy who asked me out to get some drinks. And we just went to this local, like, restaurant bar thing. I don't know. It was fun. So we just had some drinks. And we, like, it's really, we have a good relationship. Like, we can really just talk about anything and we're really, really comfortable around each other. It's just good. And, I don't know, we kind of, like, really had a serious talk last night. Like, not at the bar. But once we got home... Um, I made him watch Pretty Little Liars with me. <laughs> uh, we had like kind of a serious talk because we like tried to have a relationship back. God, when he was like a junior, not even a sophomore. Yeah. Uh, and it didn't work. And he had just got out of a bad relationship, blah, blah, blah. Regardless, it didn't work. And um, he was like, I really regret that. I don't know. Just a lot of crazy talk and he's actually moving back home but he's not from here either he just went to school out here and I'm moving so it's kind of one of those things where it's like too little too late but we both have like such 
we both have really strong feelings for one another, so it kind of sucks. Uh, but, I don't know. It was like one of those things that I wanted to hear, but once I heard it, I was like, why'd you have to tell me that now? You know, I don't know. But it was fun regardless. I had a good night last night. And uh, yeah, now I'm on my way to work. Not, not happy about it. Really, really tired. <laughs>